Maybe I'll find some people who can help me. Run, for it. Run! Or maybe slow them down. It's up to you. I've nearly run out of stamina. And I don't know how far I'm going. What? Oh crap, I'm running out of stamina. They're gonna shoot at me! Ow! I'm going slower. Ow! Ow! I like the difficulty of the game. <laughs> I'm bleeding, I need someone to heal me. I'm just running to A thinking, okay, I'm thinking someone's going to heal me here. <clears throat> Kill him! I really like games when they're quite hard. Nice! Oh, get out of it, lads! Yeah, I'm right. Hit it. You better kill one of them. Didn't get him, did ya? Nearly killed me, though. So I need someone to banish me, I need to heal. Heal, you can sleep to heal, right? I think. And it also saves. Go. Okay. This is cool, man. Combat's so hard at first. <laughs> Fucking hell, yeah. Manhunt, I remember Manhunt. That was, that was alright again. <clears throat> Dude, I was nearly dead. Someone give him a drink. And bring hot wine and bandages. Nice. So I can't actually even bandage myself yet, you need to learn it. I wonder if you learn it from once they do it. Tell me, boy. Who are you? And where are you from? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They killed my parents? They burned they it killed to the everyone. ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe mm. Tatars? Tartars, you said. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. Yeah, he's kind of... He ain't just a peasant, I don't think. I'm gonna pull that arrow out. Fainted, maybe. Easy. All done. I was looking at the craftsmanship. The arrow missed the bone. Yuck. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you stand? I'm going to have the cripple thing on, where I can't run. That's what it said. There you go. As good as new. <laughs> Thank you. If you idlers nothing better to do, get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Dibbish. Can you manage? Hmm. Pulling that arrow out is the worst thing to do. It can be, yeah. It can cause loads of bleed out, can't it? Sir. Kingdom Come Deliverance, yeah, that's what this game is. I heard, Robert. Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you see the ensigns of the attackers? Were there any more survivors? So, um... I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a strange language. They burned Scalitz to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. 
It said they came to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Sacking Gutenberg must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Skalitz is a small castle, sir. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. <laughs> Indeed, Sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. You think we're next in line? Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry, son of the Scalitz blacksmith. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. Mm. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you for risking your neck to warn us. Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. As you command, sir. What is this game on uh, console? Is it 30 FPS or is it 60? Does anyone know? Talmberg. Now oh, I can talk to him. So we're in a new town. It's more fortified, isn't it? Whoa! I discovered my bed. Yay! So I've got all hunger. Shit! I need to eat. Oh my god, what in the fuck? Is this me? I've got something. Oh, I need to sleep too. Hey. Be a bit more I'm trying to walk past. I'm looking for where my bed is. Crap. Oh, it's well more fortified this place, isn't it? I don't think it's in here. No. Yeah, it's a private area. Bits in here. It looks like it's in here. Yeah. Whoa. That's my bed. Is there anything to eat? Lockpick. I still don't have it. I think I need to sleep. Where, where is tiredness? Does it say? Energy filter. I need to eat. Oh, I have, I have some cheese, right? Can't eat it though. Energy minus three. Eat. Oh, there we go. 25. So this is money. Whoops, I've got a key one. I think that's money. Some type of money. Ooh. So that's my sword. No, it isn't. Yeah, wait. Can I... Wait, is that the same one? Main hand. I think that means it's equipped. Wait. Yeah, it does. Okay. I see. Comes there. Can I turn him? No. Ah, there it is. Tiredness, hunger. Right. What the hell is this shit? Right, okay, I'm getting it. So this is kind of like your uh, your equip thing. It gives you the idea there, it gives you that. It's really nicely designed, isn't it? Don't you think? Don't you think this is like really nicely designed, guys? Rise of Oblivion, yeah, but way nicer, right? It's got the Oblivion kind of things, and it's got like way nicer just look, just in general. Visiting in. I'm gonna sleep. My um, my energy is really low. Whoa. Sit. Can I only sit? Oh, then you sleep. All right, let's sleep. You can't delay. No time to lose. What? Game. I need to sleep.
What am I supposed to <laughs> Does it want you to faint? So I have to talk to her. There's no time to lose. I guess it's giving you the uh, impression of if this happened, you'd be all like oh, limping and... Lives. Yeah, I need food. Whatever, let's just talk to him. I need food, I need You've sleep. Well, I'm sorry for your loss. You must be all done in. Why don't you go to the kitchen and have a good meal? Ah! Sorrow is easier to bear on a full stomach. Nice, there you go, that's why. Damn it. I know, lad. Uh, is it in here? There we go. Ah, milady. You are fortunate our good lady Stephanie of Tomberg has graced us with her presence. My lady, I'm honored. So this is our brave young man. Welcome, lad. Bojana here will take care of you. No doubt you're tired and hungry. <laughs> Indeed. How could he not be, poor soul? After everything he's been through, he must be as hungry as a bear, aren't you, young master? Here you are, then. Hey. Eat your fill. And a little wine to wash it down. Mm. Thank you, my lady. <clears throat> He's gonna be drunk. When you're done, you can go and rest with the grooms in the outer valley. No, that won't do, Sir Robard. After all he's been through, he deserves a proper bed. Let him sleep in a lodge in the courtyard. Certainly, my lady. Hmm. Young Henry here is overwhelmed by your generosity. Oh, yes, uh. yes, thank you, my lady. May God reward you for your kindness. So the voice acting's good in everything, isn't it? And I don't think it was originally English. Okay. I'll leave you to it. Good night. Good night. I heard it's a kickstarter. They've done bloody amazing, haven't they? They have. They have. When you've done, you can sleep in the bedchamber of the courtyard lodge. And don't forget to take off those filthy boots and forget it. It does look good, doesn't it? That's <laughs> crazy. I don't even know about this game, and it looks so fucking well done. <laughs> <clears throat> reviews? I don't really look at reviews. I look at me ish, but you know, I don't really take a tart. I mean, didn't you see that uh, Cuphead reviewer who couldn't even get past tutorial? Uh, I don't give a shit about reviewers. Look where you're going! Oi! Be a bit more careful! Um, can I eat anything? Eat. Lentil mash. Must eat. Okay. There you go. Oh, I didn't eat it. I picked it up. Wait, will I be able to just do this, or will it will it be annoyed? Ethan Pot. There we go. Because now I can actually pick this up and keep it. What am I on? Okay, I'm on 34. I still need a lot more. Okay, can I grab you? Okay. Bread rolls. Will it go off, guys, do you think? Do you think the food will go off? Because it is going quite real, like, for the realism. I hope it doesn't. <laughs> but I bet it does. God damn it, man. He's still quite hungry, it looks like. Now, let's see. Food. Alright. Eat an apple. Eat an apple. Two of these. Get some cheese. Some mash. A few of these. 107? What's that mean? Overeating. Ah. Hmm. Didn't know the thing. Well, I know it's a thing in real life, but... You've eaten too much. You won't get hungry for a much longer time now, but you'll be heavy-handed and clumsy until you digest everything. Whoa, dude, he like, look, he like falls asleep, he's fucking blinking, like, oh my god, man. <laughs> like, he, he went like that. Did you see? Oh, there. That's him doing it. Hmm. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> Okay, he needs to sleep. Is it is it the same place, or did they change it? There's a thing here, whatever this is. What is this? I don't think this is it. Whoa, God, I can't hardly see. 
Okay, I think it does want me to go here now. Uh, zero one, zero thing of the bits. Find analytical view is much more uh, plausible than the reviewers. Yeah, reviewers are... Um, also, Silverhawk missed that. Uh, it's awesome to see you playing a game like this. I'll be buying it because of you. It looks good, doesn't it? All right, let's sleep. If you're tired, your stamina will, uh, and eloquence will also gradually decrease. Sleep is the solution. Find an available bed, which you recognize from that icon on the compass. Sit on it and then launch... Sit on it. Launch sleep. <laughs> it's all realistic. It says launch sleep. Okay. Um, there we go. We're going back to normal. Oh, crap. Um... Oh crap, okay. That gives me all my energy back, but it takes my nourish nourishment. Come for 80%? Interesting. Okay, we'll sleep until, I guess, four. It's gonna be night. So there is a day night cycle, right? Huh. Um, Epectac7, thank you for the bits. Uh, all food rot with different amounts of time. Uh, so you really need to keep sure you've got, make sure you've got food and everything, don't you? Bloody hell. You die so easy. Yes. And you can't auto save. <laughs> Oh, she got some food. My lady. Um. No, no, not at all. But what brings you here at this hour? I thought you could do with a little wine. Oh God. It's just what you need to help you sleep. But it has hangover things. Thank you. You really shouldn't. I guess it's just showing you everything, right? I think he's going to hang over. I was going to. But to tell you the truth, I couldn't sleep either. I thought of you while saying my prayers. How awful it must have been for you. I came to offer you solace. To mm. let you know you're not alone. Thank you. How can people say this is bad voice acting? You're welcome. This is why I don't give a shit about reviewers. Henry, I know this is all very new and strange for you. But I want you to feel at home here. Some of them get fucking paid to, to give good reviews. It's getting better. God knows you've been through a terrible ordeal. I know what it or is bribed. to be left alone in the world. Although your loss is much greater. But with God's help, the pain will ease in time. And it can help to talk about it. That's always first of a sex. <laughs> it's Twitch. <laughs> so I slept, so... Sure, it might give us charisma. I'll tell you what happened. It was terrible and unexpected. The day started just like any other. Father sent me into town. I guess we'll see, Goblin. Oh, crap. Oh! Oh, crap! A fellow by the name of Kunner showed money to Father, who sent me... It's got timed! <laughs> That's what I've always wanted. <laughs> it got a bit heated, as often happens when there's money involved. But Kunner still wouldn't cough up the coin. Father was too generous for his own good. Let I do want to go strength, but I don't want to go too far on strength. Success. When I'd done all the errands, I headed back home. I promised Father I'd help him with his work, and I was looking forward to it. He was forging a sword for Sir Radley. Oh, it says. I can actually see what she has. There we go. The sword was I can actually see. Himself came nice. It. I need to get better with that, so I can Father see what they want. <clears throat> He could easily make a living in Prague or Vienna. You don't say. But Sigismund's horde was already on the horizon, ready to attack the town. Oh my god, guys. 
Okay, she just wants this. Oh, wait, I can do speech as well. I saw smoke on the horizon from a village Sigismund pillage. It might give me different things if I do that. I don't know. The same fate. God have mercy. And then death descended on Scalitz. Five. Father told me to take shelter in the castle while he went to get mother. She was stranded in the town, surrounded by Sigismund butchers. They should always do timed. Dude, this, they've done it right with a lot of stuff on this. Like, like, you can't save scum as easy. And everything's, like, timed. I said this on Witcher, if you remember. It'd be nice if it was, like, timed on, like, everything. Saw father and charged at him. He cut down my father without a thought. And then he turned on my mother. And he murdered her in cold blood. He's definitely going to want revenge. May the Lord have mercy on their souls. I ran to the castle like I know. Yes! Wow! <laughs> well, fuck yeah! To save myself. Oh! Good timing. <laughs> uh, Shy Guy Thief, a very different tip. Top tip all but the day, by the way. Love watching you, please. I uh, love watching you play single player games through Please Make This a Habit. We'll see, man. I like multiplayer more. But this is interesting. It's really well done. It was Teresa, the mill wench. She'd been caught by a gang of cumin savages who planned to violate her. I had Sir Radzik's sword, and even though there were several of them and they were better armed, I had to try and save her. I wanted there to be at least one person I'd helped. And I succeeded, even though it almost cost me my life. After that, I stole a horse from them and rode off. Like a valiant knight. I'll never forget the horror. Hmm. It will haunt me for the rest of my life. Got a good rep with her, though. I learnt woman's of something. How could something like that happen? We did well with her. God alone knows why he let such things happen. And I wonder if I learned like charisma more or something. I don't know how that works yet. Understand your grief, but God is not uh, Epex, thank you for the bits. Uh, as far as I know, there are several different endings for each quest, and the game is always advancing the story, even if you don't take care of following. Okay, interesting. It's so interesting, man. And my husband either. Also, in comparison to all the little mechanics they've used, I think they've done a really good job. I was young when I married my husband. It was my father's wish. Divish was a lot older than I, but a woman must bear her lot. Shortly after our marriage, before I even got a look at Talmberg, the castle was stormed and my husband was imprisoned. Really? My husband had some quarrel with Sir Havel Medek of Valdek, who decided to resolve it by force. He stormed the castle, burned down the village of Pribislavitz. What the hell is names? Many of our men. Even the old chamberlain. Pribislavitz. He imprisoned my husband in the castle and put his own garrison there. That's awful. I was barely 18 years old and... All of a sudden, I was left alone with Sir Robert. We didn't know what to do. We went to Prague to appeal to the king and sought help from Divish's friends, but all to no avail. We tried for years, but it seemed I was destined to be left alone and my husband to rot in jail in his own castle. Years, you say? Seven years. That's how long it took before Havel was condemned as an enemy of the crown. And even then, he refused to surrender the castle and release my husband. In the end, I raised the money to pay a ransom. And only then, by the grace of Lord Jesus, did I finally lay eyes on my husband once more. Seven years. And um, was Havel punished for it? Never. And after seven years, my husband returned to me an infirm old man. Hmm. Sir so Divish seems like a good, strong man. Well, certainly. Only he has many concerns. He had to rebuild Talmberg, 
After he was released, the king appointed him Burgrave of Prague Castle, and he was very busy. He had no time for me at all. But at least we were in the city, and there was something going on. And now, we're here. My lady, you're still young and beautiful. Your best years are still ahead of you. Would that that were true, lad. Would it were true. Would it? <laughs> but what am I doing bothering you with this? You have troubles enough of your own. I'll go and let you sleep. Would it? I enjoyed our little talk, Henry. Good night, and God bless. Good night, my lady. Probably good for him to get it off his chest, that. Oh my god, guys, swear. <laughs> Every time. Uh, <clears throat> woman in the Middle Ages, okay. Oh, it's Nightmare. Don't want to miss this. What is it? What's happening? Come to the battlements. One of our patrols reported a company heading here from Skellets. Hmm. We're looking good though. We got uh, everything. Wait, we leveled up though, didn't we? Like, it hasn't even mentioned this yet. I'm pretty sure we leveled up. But I haven't put any... That was annoying. All the people are sleeping. Uh -huh. I can't see anything, guys. I seriously can't see anything. It's completely black. Oh my god, it's way too dark. I seriously can't see anything in there. Might need to turn the uh, brightness up. We'll see though. It's nice having the immersion, but if it's like unseeable, then yeah. Might need to change it up. I, I didn't think of that. Balance. I'm guessing it's down here. Oh, whoa, it's like raining. I can barely see. I forgot my torch. It said grab a torch. It told me to take a torch. God damn it! I couldn't see anything. Let's grab that torch. Wow, I can't see anything. I'm literally just memorizing where I came from. <laughs> Can I grab one of these? No. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if you need a light at night, use your torch by holding... What is that? R? I don't know what button that is. I? No, it can't be I. What the fuck button is that? <laughs> L? T? Oh, it means just go to inventory, right? And then equipped it this way, maybe? Maybe it means that. Now it's there. Okay. And then... Okay, how do I, um, how do I put it back in, though? So now I've got my weapon and a torch. Huh. Okay, whatever. Yeah, it is raining, as I expected. <laughs> I think it started raining heavier, what the hell? 
I think it's raining heavier. Is it dynamic weather? Hello. What? What the hell are you doing? You told me to come here. What's going on? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Why would Sigismund advance on Talmud in the night? Especially since he's lost the element of... What a pretty game. Really is, man. It's ridiculous. I think it's an open world as well. The scouts give us sent to Scarlet to spy on Sigismund. Said he'd set up camp and this is ridiculously good game, man. So far. Radzig is an experienced soldier. He'd surely hold the castle for quite some time. It doesn't make sense. What else did the spies see? Not much of anything. Before they could get close enough, this huge storm started. And you were right. Sigismund has a hell of a lot of soldiers, including all manner of mercenaries. An army like that costs a fortune. Well, anyway, we'll find out when they get here. Well, the map, the map, sixteen kilometers. Are you kidding? How big is this game? Halt! Who goes there? Lucifer and all his minions. Who else, Robber? Sir Ansig. What a relief. Ah. Uh. Lordship, there with you. Yes, sir. He is right here. The scouts. Got it wrong. So late, Divish. At your age, you need a good night's sleep. <laughs> well, Radzik, you didn't exactly pick the best time for an outing either. <laughs> In a big hurry? It was a bit of a scramble, all right. Believe it or not, this tempest is a godsend for me and my men. As my old granddad used to say, better a sore throat than a slick throat. I'd say your grandfather was a wise man. Your messenger told us what happened. Messenger? <laughs> the lad you sent to warn us. He's alive? He made it to you? He's here mm -hmm. with me. He only got away by the skin of his teeth, though. Thank God. A brave young man. But tell me, friend, how on earth did you manage to get away? Thank God for this tempest. When it began, Sigismund's Tatars crawled into their holes and left a storm in the castle for more clement weather. Uh, we were able to sneak out right so it's not there. dynamic. We might be, but it isn't in this cutscene. We wouldn't have stood a chance against them. Would you like to spend the night in Tumber? No, no. When Sigismund finds the castle empty tomorrow, he might come looking for us. Hmm. He'd only be exposing you to danger. Without me and my men, he has no call to attack you. Well, what will you do then? We'll march to Ratai. It's only a short way, and there we'll have a better chance of defense and enough room for all of these people. Hmm. If Sigismund should come, better bend your knee, Divish. There's no point dying in a battle that's futile. You're right there. Is that boy still with you? Does he want me to I'm come? Here, sir. He probably does. You have courage, lad. That I can't deny. I am sorry about what happened. Yes. Would you care to join us? I'd like to, sir, but first I have to return to Skellix. Are you mad? <laughs> what do you want there? I can't leave my mother and father. I won't leave their corpses rotting mm. in the streets. I'll join you once I've taken care of them. Don't even think of going back there, you donkey. Yeah. Are you tired of living? Well, sir, quiet! <laughs> I'm sorry about your father. We'll definitely die if we went back. I won't help him. Divish, make sure that lad doesn't budge from Talmberg until things quiet down. Not to worry, friend. Anyway, he's injured and needs to recover. I'll lock him up here as if he were hovel. I wanted, I wanted to go with him. I see you've grown a thick skin since your tribulation, sir. But thank you. You donkey. We'll meet again when <laughs> circumstances are more favorable. That sucks. Farewell. Should have joined him. Friend. And good fortune. Give my regards to Sir Hanish. I will. And good luck to you. What do we call if it let you choose? It's a dark time. It's looking really good, uh, George. Jojo. There's lo loads, man. Like, tiredness, not only are you tired, but it shows it, and you, like, stop drifting off and stuff. Uh, hunger. He starts, like, talking about how hungry he is, etc. 
It's quite short, isn't it? Oh no, no. Oi. <laughs> I keep doing that. Oh. I could use an extra pair of eyes, and yours are keen. Will you keep watch on the battlements with my men? Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request you answered yes to. Of course I'll help. I have to pay you back somehow after all you've done for me. Very deep voice, just realised. Don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. Oh, yeah. Keep a watch. Just checking out what's over here. I don't think it wants me to go up here. It might. How does this map look? I ain't even looked at it. Oh, oh my god. Whoa. Wait, is, is this just the map then? This? Well, I say just the map. So we came from here and we, we did that, um, that... That's when we were running, weren't we? We were running away. Could be a massive town here, couldn't there? Or like a big city. Could be some stuff up there as well. Oops, shit. Wait, if you do that, wait. If I go like that... Okay, that's just if you zoom really in, okay. So this. Unexplored places. Whoa, dude. What the fuck? How much passion is in this game? <laughs> That's fucking well nice. Are you kidding? That's a map. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. <laughs> oh. Mental. <laughs> um, why does he want me to go? What's that? Baker. It said to keep watch. The hell? I haven't known. I just decided to go because it's high up. Oh shit, I'm in a private place. Uh, I'm kind of curious now. Oh, lockpick! I want this now. Can I not grab this? I can steal. If you steal, you uh, make sure no one sees you, but even selling loot isn't easy. You might get away with selling a soul on ap Apple, but the word will get around if you steal something valuable, and traders will recognise it. Try going to a trade as far away as possible from the scene of the theft. Fuck it, hell, man. <laughs> There's a bone arrow here. Wait, wait, wait. Sure. Is someone walking here? Oh shit. Oh uh, crap. Oh crap. It might have seen. I just saw a bone arrow. What I could have got, potentially. I'm on 50, uh, con con conspicuous, whatever it was. Yeah, I got I, I self to wait. Oh shit! Oh fuck! Wandering around like a stray sheep. Okay, might be okay. Yeah, I can use that. Much will be happening today. You can just lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's Sure. Thank you. Nice. You got away with it. Go away so I can get the ball. Nice. So many. It's quite slow. 
Can I get this? I won't be able to get these. No. That'd be too good. We got a bow and arrow. Oops! I whistled. Oh, I'm gonna fall. I don't know why I'm getting these arrows, but they might be good. I won't be selling them. Can I go down here? My curiosity. Oh my god, this shield. Dude, I can get a shield. I'm getting all this shit and they probably will just give it me as well. It's fine though, just in case. I don't have lockpicks game. Ah. Ah, okay. So this is like a tower, hello. I can, oops, I keep doing that. So can I go in this way or not? Okay, cool, I got some stuff. Someone went in there, I won't be able to get any more though. Unless he went, oh, hello. I think it's allowing me to sleep as well, I think. Equipped. Oh, nice, okay, equipped. I have, I don't have 120 of them, do I? Do I have 120 of these? I have 120. <laughs> nice. I've got a shield. If it's stolen, will they know that it's stolen? Oh, nice. That'll go there. Here's all. 42 damage, right? I think. I have one. Oh, that's the number. That's how much it does. Yeah, I see. This is the one I've got. Okay. And that's the damage. Yeah, so that's a better one. There we go. We're getting some stuff, boys. If that's all stolen, so I don't know what they'll do about that. I don't know if that'll be okay or not. Oops, I did it again. Let me use ladder. Shh. So let me use ladder. Oh crap. Lockpick. Very hard. Dude, if I had a lockpick, man. Well, we know these are here. We just need to find a lockpick. Oh, can I? Oh, I did it again. Can we not use it? I can't use this ladder. Is it because I've. Guys, I can't use this ladder. Oh, I used it. What the fuck? He's just chilling, man. He's just chilling. Trapped. I were hitting you, obviously. I need to get a lockpick. And apparently to get lockpicks, you need to talk to someone who's really shady. Damn. If I just talk to one of these, what happens? You can talk to him like, properly. God be with you. What do you think about how the Skelet's folk managed to flee the siege? Thank the Lord. I thought it was Sigismund descending on us. Look at me, all my soul and shit. <laughs> well, we were all expecting the worst. And the truth is, I'm still worried what will happen when Sigismund comes here. And come he will, of that I'm sure. I just hope we'll be as fortunate when we're face to face with that fucker. By the way, Henry, my condolences. That's nice of you. Hmm. I wonder if that gives me charisma or anything. Oi! Hmm. He's kind of trying to ignore me. Do they all sound the same? No. They don't. Do they all say something different? managing to slip away like that. I can't imagine how they would the more I think about it, there was either blessed or Sigismund's mercenary army ain't up to much. When you're on campaign, you keep watch no matter how much it's pissing down. If any of us makes such a cock-up, Sir Robot will flare his skin up our backs. 
Flair. Because you never saw them attack. Aye. Well, it's a shame your folks couldn't be saved. Is the robot really that tough? Tough? Aye. But he's fair. He's a veteran of many a campaign, so he knows Warcraft. I believe it. Hmm. Why do people say... I still don't see this, this voice acting, what's really bad. It seems really good to me. Um, Kirk, thank you for the very generous tip. Committing theft and, uh, and uh, stealthing while holding a torch high above your head. To attack you. Uh, love the stream today. This game looks fucking awesome. I don't know how to get rid of my torch. Oh, shit. I didn't mean to. Okay, I can get rid of it by pressing 2, but it, it gets my uh, ball. I mean, I can do this to get rid of it, but it's just awkward. Oh, wait, I could probably maybe press here. Oh, okay. Oh, but then it just goes. But it's quicker, I guess. Okay. But then I need to do that again. Mm, whatever, it's not too bad. It's a bit awkward. I'd, I'd, pr I'd pr Hold one. Hold one. Oh. So, one is that. Holding one goes to offhand. One is that. And then holding one goes to offhand? No, I think it's different with the ball. But that one, it looks like it's like that. Alright, cool. So if I press one, it goes to the uh, the sword, right? I think so, yeah. So it's the same with the shield, I'm guessing, right? Wait. I don't even need to have it equipped, I just hold one. That's my sword and shield, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Look, I got my shield there. I can hardly see, though. Wait. That's me blocking. Okay. And then holding one gets the torch, and it takes away the shield. If I hold it again, it gets rid of it, and the shield's gone as well. So I need to remember that. It's weird. All right. <clears throat> This is where I went. All right, let's uh, let's sleep then. Pretty much done what they said. Map is changing based on recent events. Look at the middle town at the map. You can see Sigmund's army is there. What? The fuck? You mean this? Wait, does this, is this actually because they're here? Does it actually do that? Like these flames wouldn't be here or anything. I didn't check it before, so I don't know. But wouldn't this be all demolished if that was true? Because look, it's all chill here. I don't know. I'm not sure about that yet, but the, the maps look beautiful anyway, even without that. <clears throat> oh, I've got my sword out here. Uh, there we go. Alright, let's get back to uh, sleep, I guess, because that's what it seemed they wanted. Is this stuff rotting? I should eat it, shouldn't I? Nourishment 93. Uh, just an apple. Oops. 95, that's fine enough. I don't want to eat too much. You can overeat, and it uh, gives you negative effects. You don't want to go over 100. Right, let's just go back to bed. It was back here, right? It was. I think he wants me to sleep. Wait until morning, yeah. Current objective. I thought he said advice. Alright, let's wait until the morning. <clears throat> he said that he wanted to uh, tell me stuff in the morning. He said for me to get to sleep, that guy. 
Can I do this? Okay, you can do it this way as well. Let's do like eight. Three hours. Energy's on 99. And we could just do nine and get full energy. Worst god ever. Yeah, but he said that he's going to teach me everything after I sleep. I'm pretty sure. Don't sleep. Well, I did. <laughs> pretty sure it said current uh, current objective to sleep as well. Oh no, it said wait until the morning. I guess it's a bit different. Uh, go to the battlements of the outer beer layer. All right. I'm fully rested. Or you can pe press T. Yeah, that's true. You can do that as well. But it's the same thing. Except less comfort. Oh my god. There they are. Like before. It's deja vu for him. Is this his nightmare? See how the self appointed king wins the love and respect of his loyal subjects. Indeed, Robard. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. You may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. That's the bastard who let the attack of Scullis and kill my parents. Don't be an idiot. If you don't want to end up like them. I am Man, the cool. Marquardt von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Hmm. Restore order by burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Markvard. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. Ugh. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king, and here in Townburg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then do we owe the honor of your visit? Yesterday, his majesty took action against the enemy of the kingdom, Sir Ratzik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Scarlet's mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik of which you speak is the king's hetman at Skalitz. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not a Talbur. He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle where he has little chance of defense to another where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? Hmm. Am I to inform the king then that Zeratsi Kobila is not a Tamburg and that he has your loyalty? Sir Radzig Kobila is not here, and I have no intention of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay your words to the king in the hope he will be as well disposed as you seem to be. Those who have clean consciences and good will may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this, when there is little cause for joy. Farewell, sir. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. Are they going to 1v1? <laughs> no.
God. Could have done like that or something and then they just attack. <clears throat> the power! The power! Oh shit, I'll see him. Maybe not, I don't know. Might not remember him. <clears throat> what? What? The hell are you doing? Hmm? Is there a way you can walk? Can I move past you? It wants me to go somewhere, but I think it wants me to, like, wait for these guys to get there. Combat arena, cool. That's that place. Huh. It's slow. Back here. It's all the same to me, this system. As long as there's law and order. Then it's better to have women. Press caps locks to walk. Oh yeah, there you go. What if I could just talk to him here? What the hell? Maybe actually. My respect to you. Actually, I think this is where I needed to... Ah. Oh. He's so determined to go back there. I mean, they're not there anymore, so maybe I can. Yeah, I think I think maybe I should go back there now. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left. The place would be swamped with robber barons, brigands, deserters, and other vermin. Mm. Anyway, your lord commanded you to stay here. Oh, okay. Oh, shit! Okay, it's not timed. It should always be timed. Um. Ah! It's a robot. My parents died there. I can't leave them to be eaten by dogs. What would you do in my place? Send for work. Oh, fuck! I won't take orders. You'll have to wait until everything settles down, and maybe your lord will change his mind. Shit, well, I can't do it then. Why did Sigismund burn down Scarlet? I think he'd laugh at that, saying that's the, the fucking wind. fine thing. Certain lords have resolved to take things into their own hands and eliminate... Everything should be timed. It seriously should be. It, it's Fortune way better that way, I think. And what's more, he was sitting on a pile of silver that could help King Wenceslas' allies. Yeah, I know that. I don't know why I asked. I'm just asking because it might give me something. Gutenberg. Well, I'm just a simple soldier, but the good lord gave me ears. And I've heard some things from Sir Divish. Um, Floor Silence, it looks really interesting. There's loads to it. Indeed. There's a lot of passion involved. You can see that. Came to see me because I knew them from before. I see. Listen, lad. These are all games of the high aristocracy. In Prague, a cabal of nobles rebelled against King Wenceslas. Wealthy aristocrats who took against our king for reasons of their own. There's no doubt Sigismund had his fingers in the whole affair. Him and Wenceslas's cousin, Jobs. And that cabal helped him abduct the king. So then why did Sigismund attack Kuttenberg? Why do you think? Hmm. Well, was it a strong position? So this is why it should be timed for everything. Because, I don't know. I mean, that seems like the one he's asking about, isn't it? That or the, what he's saying about, but it could be more. It could be the granaries. Were there many granaries there? The position weren't that amazing, was it? I'm going to say uh, granaries. Because it's a fertile place with full granaries that could feed Sigismund's troops. <laughs> That's not it. Oh. King Charles, may God grant him eternal glory, built Prague into a proper royal city, while King Wenceslas took a liking to Kutenberg. 
After Prague, it's the most important city in Bohemia, in the entire Holy Roman Empire. He who commands the Kutenberg Silver is king. So Kutenberg sided with Wenceslas because he favored it. Now you're starting to understand. When Sigismund imprisoned Wenceslas and took control of Prague, 